Okay, y'all, all the braids are done. So let me show it to you. Okay, so what I did again, I just put two around here and I put um, braided it all to the back. Um, the best thing to do, I kind of was being a little lazy. If you want to, you actually can make this out of two. Um, but anyway, what I do is I connect them all together, like just put them in the back. And what I have done is I have already got my thread and my um, my uh, sewing thread and my needle. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to just sew that, just connect it to other braids. I mean, you can just place it various different braids. But what you're doing is you're sewing the ends to your hair. So you don't got to worry about your ends once you start sewing in your actual track hair. So again, just hold it and braid it. Hold it tight. And just kind of just various braids just attach them to each other and it's really easy it's not hard at all so yeah, that's how I do it so it won't all be looking crazy and bumpy and stuff you always want to connect the ends and again there's a bunch of different techniques you can do you know however you want to corn roll it whatever you feel is best for you it's all will come out pretty if you um, most definitely lay the weave right so again, I just keep going and I connect several braids to different braids, just up, down, up, down motion. And pull it tight so you can make sure to thread it. Don't go all crazy so you can be able to know how to take it down. Once it's time to take it down, because I know this one girl did my um so and she went up right down right so it was crazy trying to get it out. So just be mindful of your client or well as yourself when you're doing a sew in. Would it be hard for you to take it out when you're doing someone else's hair? Always remember that and think that you want it as easy as possible for the client to take out if they want to take it out, because they really can just come to you. But some people don't have enough, you know, money. It's a recession. They can't come back. So, um, again, what I did was I just um, sewed all the hair, connected all the hair together and stuff. And and I'm going to clip off the, um, the thread. And just kind of, if you want to, you can put like a little tie in it. If you want to, it's up to you. You don't got to. Just go ahead and cut it. So again, I just showed you how to prep your hair to be able to do your sew-in or a quick weave glue-in. Um, so again, I am about to start doing the sew-in. Um, this is going to be a part two. So uh, just stay tuned for more. Please rate, subscribe, and be blessed. And I'll be back at y'all. Bye, y'all.